our daughter was diagnosed with infantile spasms at eight months old. Each spasm is catastrophic and can cause brain damage and mental retardation. It started with her eyes rolling back, which didn't concern her pediatrician. We knew something was wrong with our baby, but no one else saw anything wrong. The eye doctor said everything looked fine. We plan to go to a neurologist next. Her symptoms were getting worse within hours, and we were told to video her episodes to help with the diagnosis. Thanks to some parents on a Facebook group, we realized how serious this could be. We brought her to Boston Children's Hospital emergency room the next morning. She had an episode well there and was admitted immediately. During a long, emotional and scary week at the hospital, we learned it all about this rare form of infant epilepsy. We needed to choose what treatment to try first because there were serious side effects. We had to learn to give her injections of a high-dose steroid that she would be on for at least a month. We gave her injections every day and quarantined due to the side effects of a drastically lowered immune system. She gained weight and was always hungry and miserable which was so hard to see. It was all worth it. Her spasms stopped after a few weeks. She's been seizure-free for almost four years now.